I don't see what, how I look old. I gotta get out of here. I'm looking at myself in this mirror. It's just like I'm in here wasting away. Uh, maybe I can try. I got to see. Me. I got to see Michael. Why did my daughter stick me in this nursing home? Look at yourself, Eloise. You're gonna be all right. Tell yourself, you're gonna be all right. You're a strong woman. Oh, I can't take this no more. I'm getting out of here. Who can I call? Uh, oh, my goodness. Uh, calm down. I'm getting upset as I'm thinking. Uh, uh, don't look like that to me. You're ugly. At least your nails done. <laughs> oh, I could call Applewood Nursing Center. Let me see some nursing homes in here. I gotta get away. I can't stand that. That caregiver starting to get on my nerves. Here's one. Let's see. I hate now. It could take forever to die. It's gonna be all right, other beast. Oh. Well, maybe they're not open. That's, that's... Yes, my, what's your name, Marlena? Yes. Marlena, my name is Miss Eloise Jenkins, and I'm looking to find a nursing home uh, that's better than the one I'm in, because I don't like it here, and I'm not happy. Okay, so um, our office staff they come in at 8.30 in the morning. So that's a little more than an hour away from now. Okay, well let me ask you a question. What's the, what's the amenities there? The, like, do you get to go and come as you please in there? Yes, you can do that. Okay, because I got a car. I want to drive my car. And uh, the nursing home here tells me I can't drive my, my car if I... And it's mine. Okay, yeah, that would be something I would ask the admission still just in case because I'm one of the nurses on the floor. So sometimes it depends on what type of medication and everything that you take if it says do not operate a vehicle within a certain amount of time frame or something like that. So that's just something that I would run by then when um, you call them back at about 8.30. Oh, okay. I, 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 this is the question for you. I, you, I know you call them back. Do y'all have king-size beds? Queen, because I was trying to think about me and Michael. Maybe we can move there or something. Okay. All right, well, I'm going to call you back at 8.30, and I'd appreciate you. What is it, Magdalene? Marlena. Marlena. Oh, thank you, Marlena. God bless you, baby. Oh, you're so welcome. God bless you, too. All right, baby. All right. Uh -huh. 
Now things was gonna be looking up, she. <laughs> I'm gonna get out of here. She, that, that, that caregiver, Tina. <laughs> I'm getting out of here. And I, and I, and I, I'm thinking about not telling what my daughter where I'm gonna be. Uh, let me check another one just to see here. Let me have you a list of them. Uh-huh. Don't play around with me, honey. I'll get gone on you. <laughs> What's this up? Huh? So they think I'm a fool to treat me any old kind of way. Why am I talking to myself in the mirror? Oh, well, I guess all I got is myself. Uh, cheer up. Cheer up, baby. It's going to be all right. Now, here's another one. I'm going to call this one. I need a king size bed for me and Mike. Cause he's coming too. He ain't won't even let him come here. What's, this place is terrible, low income. I'm rich. My daughter's rich. Good morning, Life Care Center of Michigan City. This is Peggy. How can I help you? Hi, Peggy. How are you? I'm fine, honey. Who is this? My name is Ma Miss Eloise Jenkins. And I was in Eloise. Eloise. Okay. Uh huh. And I was searching for some nursing homes of, to my liking. Okay. And I just wanted to know what your your facilities are. Or, or what the, what are you like? What is it like there? Are you free there? Or are you you're restricted? What? Because I just feel like where I'm at, I'm restricted. Where, where are you at right now, honey? Well, I'm in Sunny Glen. Okay. And I... What kind of needs do you have? I have, I just, I just need, my, I just need to be loved. And I just want to know, do, do y'all have the, the beds of your choice? Because I would like to have a king size bed. And what my, I can, what I can take is your number and have someone from uh, admissions call you, okay? Oh, how long do you think that's going to take if I get my well, number? Well, here. It's, it's Monday. Brittany, give me a piece of scrap paper over by the computer there. I don't know how to wait. Okay. Uh, God, you said your first name is Eleanor? Eloise. Eloise, I'm sorry. E-L-O-I-S-E. -E. And what's your last name? Jenkins. Jenkins. J-E-N-K-I-N-S. Yes. You're Sonny Glenn? Yes. Okay, can you give me your phone number? Yes. Hold on a second, let me look here. Okay, honey. It's seven, three, four, four, five, two, three, two, two, two. Oh. Two one nine seven three four four five two two four five two two. Okay. All right. And you said you you need a king size bed. Yes. Okay. I kind of want me and my friend to come and stay there. Are you talking? Are you talking assisted living uh, type setup? I'm, what you're looking for? I'm talking freedom living. I don't need no assistance. And my daughter thinks I need some assistance. I don't need no assistance. I'm grown and I can do what I want to do. Okay. I can uh, have someone call you from admissions, Eloise, okay? Okay, I really appreciate it. Did you say that you want your friend to come and stay here with you? Yes. Okay, is that female or male? No, I got a man, honey. Okay. So you're looking for a living arrangement for you and uh, your significant other, then, correct? That's right, because we just want to be happy and alone without young people telling us what to do. Okay. All right, I'll turn this information over to admissions, and yes. they'll be giving you a call, okay? Uh, yeah, I don't understand how the world switched around like that. I thought that right. old, older people tell... Younger people, what to do, but I agree. they tell telling us what to do. I agree. It's like the world's all backward nowadays. Yes. It's uh, like when you're a grown, 
you're when you're a grown up, you should be able to do what you want. That's right, and I'm in my right mind. I'm not crazy. Don't check on me. Nobody wants thinks you're crazy, okay? Okay. We'll see what we can do for you, Eloise. Okay, I promise I'll give this to admissions, and we'll see what we can do for you, okay? Okay. Thank you. You're welcome, sweetheart. Okay. You have a good day. You too. Okay. Bye bye. Bye. <laughs> She showed me. That's what I'm talking about. See how did this? This had to make me look a little younger. Talk about get yourself a gray wig. I wish I would. See, things was looking up for me. <laughs> I would be so happy when I moved in. Me and Michael. I just know he gonna love my curls and my hair, my new hairstyle and stuff. I'm just gonna be looking nice. They're gonna call me, so I'm gonna wreck out. <laughs> and I ain't gotta worry about that old evil caregiver no more telling me what to do, bullying me. <sighs> I think I don't look too bad. Uh. Everything's gonna be all right, Eloise. Just hold on, you and Michael gonna be together sooner than everybody think. We're gonna be happy with one another. Oh, I could just sit here and look at this mirror at myself all day. I'm so clever. 